Well, today the All Facebook Network had an event. We invited a lot of different speakers to air their views. It was focused initially on the uh, Bishop's paper, but it was a free and open debate. But I think some of the people may have found the debate a bit difficult, and, and that's because we didn't stay inside the confines of nicey, nicey interfaith talk. We shone light on a number of subjects that are not often talked about in the interfaith circles. The meeting was chaired by Rabbi Reuben Livingstone. He is a barrister and adjudicator. He lectures in Jewish law and ethics at Montefiore College London School of Jewish Studies and King's College London. And he's the principal Jewish chaplain to HM Armed Forces. Message of, of this pastoral letter, um, as, as we've discussed, under, uh, under labour, according to the argument of this letter, uh, the, the power has become too concentrated in the hands of the state. Uh, under the Dr. Al Husseini is a fellow in Islamic studies at the Westminster Institute. It's a US-based academic institute researching the field of religion and public life. We were very pleased to have the Right Reverend Graham James, who is the Bishop of Norwich. He addressed primarily the question of the Bishop's paper on who is my neighbour. One of the reasons um, for the letter arose out of, I think, the experience that I and many other bishops have had in our diocese. Which was one of the focuses of the conference. I know that the speakers was Judy Kleiner. She spoke from a Jewish perspective. She is herself an Orthodox Jew and she contributed wonderfully to the discussion. Is Pandit Satish Sharma is the Secretary General of the National Council of Hindu Temples. Christian fundamentalist extremists engaged in evangelism. It's quite funny because evangelism is a positive word from the perspective of the dominant faith. But from our perspective, evangelism is radicalization, rust cultural genocide and binding one. Pandit Sharma made a very strong point about discrimination and established discrimination of Hindus in Britain. Dr. Damien Thompson was another of our speakers. Uh, he is a, a prominent journalist editorial director of the Catholic Herald and publisher of Spectator, Health, Money and Life. Some people find his views quite controversial, but they certainly gave a contribution to our talk today. The All Face Network really hopes that something very constructive is going to come out of this discussion today. I think that we shone the light on things where the light needs to be shone. We have addressed issues that are not really addressed in interfaith dialogue. It opens the door, I hope, to dialogue between different parties and I think that something very constructive will come out of this day.